What's going on, everybody? This is Shane Thomas, ready to show you another country classic on acoustic guitar. This time, this video, we are going to learn Dust on the Bottle by David Lee Murphy off the 1995 album Out With a Bang. And David Lee did indeed come out with a bang with this monster hit. Man, it seemed like it was playing all the, all the time. Such a catchy song. Oh, man, this chorus. Everybody loves singing this chorus. And I can't wait to show you this song on the acoustic guitar. Now, word of caution. We're going to be using quite a bit of bar chords in this, in this song. So if you just learn how to play the guitar, I understand that bar chords are tough. It's tough to get those fingers in the right positions, hurt your fingers and all that. But hopefully if you can, if you can persist, keep practicing, you get these chord shapes of these bar chords, you're gonna be able to not only play this song, but all kinds of songs. So hopefully this song will be uh, an exercise, if you will, of learning bar chords also. You're not only learning the, this country classic, but you're learning how to play bar chords. All right, so Shane T's got a sweet tea ready. And he's ready to show you how to play dust on the bottle. You give, get your beverage of choice, whether that's a dusty bottle of wine or from Creole Williams or your sweet tea or whatever you like to drink. If you don't get a beverage, at least get your acoustic guitar and let's learn how to play dust on the bottle by David Lee Murphy. Now let's learn the chords and the strumming pattern to dust on the bottle. We just need four chords and an upbeat tempo, and we're going to get this song down. Now, we are going to use some bar chords, which I know aren't the easiest chords in the world to play, but if you get your fingers adapted to playing them, all you got to do pretty much is just slide that same pattern with some variations up and down the neck, and I'll show you how to do that. Now the chords that we're going to need to know for this song are the B, the F sharp, the E and the G sharp minor. And when we learn how to play these chords, you're gonna get the whole song. Now, if you already know these, song, these chords that you see on the screen right now, go ahead and skip ahead to the video. I'll put some timestamps in this video so you can skip right ahead to where we're using these chords and playing along with the song. However, if you don't know these chords, the B, the E, the F sharp, and the G sharp minor. I'll put the links to video showing you how to play those chords in the description below. Now, as far as the strumming pattern goes, you, you see David Lee Murphy play it in, in different ways, but primarily it's just down strokes. But I mean, you'll see some, and I'll put the link in the description below of, you know, especially in the intro, he's got the, that kind of a rhythm kind of thing. But primarily to me, it's just downstroke. So like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That's the intro. So just a bunch of downstrokes. Dun 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 dun. And that's it. That's the strumming pattern for the song if you are playing by yourself or even if you're in a band. Now, I guess you can make the argument you could just down up if you wanted to, but it's totally up to you. I like the down strokes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That kind of groove, that kind of rhythm, and you'll know how to play the whole entire song. So speaking of playing the whole entire song, let's learn how to play Dust on the Bottle. Now that we know the chords and the strumming pattern, let's put it all together and let's learn how to play Dust on the Bottle by David Lee Murphy. Now, the intro, B, F sharp, E, back up the B, G sharp minor without the middle finger there, that's important. Then F sharp, a couple times. So I like to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That, that helps me remember it. And you do that twice, that, ro that rotation twice, that chord progression twice. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
So I keep track 1 through 14, and once I get to 14 on that E major chord, I know I finished that sequence. Now, the verses are pretty much the same chord progression as the intro was. So you start here on the B major chord, bar chord, on the 7th, 8th, and ninth fret. All right, now let's just kind of play that chord progression just like we did in the intro. Rio Williams lived down the dirt road and homemade wine like nobody I know. See that? Just like the intro. Do it again. Drop by one Friday night, said, Can you help me, Creole? Got a little girl waiting on me and I'm gonna treat her right. That's the verse. That's how you play the verses. Now we're gonna learn the pre chorus. The pre chorus starts here at the F sharp and slides up to the G-sharp minor, then down to E, and do that again. F-sharp, G minor, E, then back to F-sharp. So let's play it in its entirety, and it'll make more sense. Got what you need, son, sitting down in the cellar. Let's do the cobwebs as they turn on the light. F-sharp. Say it. <laughs> Let's go to the chorus. My beat, a little dust on the bottle. Don't let it fool you about what's inside. Do it again. My beat, a little dust on the bottle. Just one of those things get sweeter with time. Now let's play the second verse. The chords to the second verse are the same as the chords in the intro. The same as the chords in the first verse and same chords as the chorus. Y'all right there on that B major. She was sitting in the porch swing as I pulled up the driveway. Oh, I was racing as she climbed inside. Do it again. Slid over real close and drove down to the lake road. Watch the sun fade in the big red sky. All right, good. Now let's go to the pre-chorus, which is starts right here, remember, on the F sharp. And you work your way up to the G sharp minor. Reached under the front seat and said, now here's something special. Do it again. Just been waiting for a night like tonight. All right, good job. Let's go to that chorus again. My beat, a little dust on the bottom. Don't let it fool you about what's inside. Do it again. My beat, a little dust on the bottle. Just one of those things get sweeter with time. And you just keep doing that while they do the the guitar solo. And it's got a little steel solo in there too, but you're just still doing that. That same progression over and over. Nice job, y'all. Nice job. Let's go to the bridge. Now, after that steel guitar solo, after that electric guitar solo, we come to the what's called the bridge. The bridge is the section of the song that sounds like unlike any other section of the song. So it's unique. And it's much like the pre-chorus because it starts on the F sharp. Okay, so just kind of take your time, follow along. You might have to watch this several times, but we're going to play the bridge and then we're going to go into the chorus and repeat that chorus a couple times and that's the end of the song. So we start right here on F sharp. You're still with me. We made some memories. After all these years, there's one thing I found again. Some say good love is like a Wine. It's getting better as days go on time. Boom, 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 boom. Repeat that chorus again. My beat, a little dust on the bottom. Don't let it fool you about what's inside. My beat, a little dust on the bottom. Just one. 
one of those things that gets sweeter with time. Repeat the chorus again. My beat, a little dust on the bottom. Good job. Yeah. My beat, a little dust on the bottom. Just one of those things that gets sweeter with time. You can keep playing it. That chorus as long as you want, many times as you want. Because it just kind of fades out. And the electric guitar is just kind of soloing. Man, once you get this chord progression down, this song is just a, a bunch of fun to play. And of course, everybody knows this chorus. <laughs> And that's how you play Dust on the Bottle by David Lee Murphy. What a song, what a classic. Man, what a fun song to play. Once you get these bar chords down, that is. All right, if you like this video, hit that like button. If you hadn't already, I appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can get all the latest guitar tutorials to guitar lessons as soon as I publish them. All right, my name's Shane Thomas. I want y'all to keep strumming and humming. Keep these wonderful songs alive. Y'all take care. My beat, a little dust on the bottle. Don't let it fool you about what's inside.